go home to Bangor. Uh, I mean, all the love for you there. Does that kind of boost your confidence? Oh, it's overwhelming. Just the support, really, it really helps you. It honestly does. And in a way, it kind of spurs you on a bit because you want to do it for them and you want to you keep going, hopefully. Fingers crossed. <laughs> <laughs> now, uh, Rachel, obviously, Francesca left last week. Mm. The stakes are getting higher. Absolutely. Who do you now see in this final eight as your, your main competition? Oh, they're all a main competition. It is massive and it really is heating up, but... For me personally, I would see uh, Jessie to be the next Nancy. Oh, right. I think she's brilliant. She's a raw talent and she's untarnished. She's amazing. Well, I hope you're not talking yourself out of votes there, but uh, let's go over to the panel. Uh, John, Neve or Rachel? Let's do stage presence. Who do you think might have the stage presence to do this in the West End? Well, Graham, I think they both have the stage presence. Neve, first of all, it was confident, it was secure. You have a great voice, but tonight for me, Diction was the problem. Andrew said it's about words. I did not understand every word. Nancy tells a story, and you didn't tell me that story. Rachel, you have set the bar for tonight. I'm sorry. And if we're talking about story and, and words and everything, that was a story. Okay, I'm going to go to Barry next. Neve, that was wild and wayward. I think you, you really brought a new aspect to the, uh, to the character and showed another aspect of your own great talent. I thought that was, uh, was terrific. Uh, Nancy, it was an Amy Winehouse song, of course, and I think the original Nancy was probably like Amy Winehouse. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, though I don't think you'd disappoint the fans. I'm one of them, anyway. Uh, and, uh, Rachel, I agree. That was, uh, I think, your best performance so far in the competition. Oh. OK, uh, slightly split decision. Denise, what did you think? OK, Neve, I love you as a performer, but for me tonight that lacked punch, especially at the start. It felt a little bit like you were marking it, not giving a full performance, and you kind of held back a little bit on that. We need to see more from you, because you're so fragile, you have more to prove, to prove that you're right for this role. You hit some great notes, but again, I couldn't understand some of the words that you were singing. You have to work on your diction. OK, Rachel, a very strong performance, again, from you, week after week. You are very consistent. You act very well. But I find you, you've had a couple of very intense songs over the last couple mm. of weeks. So now I'm setting you a challenge for next week. I want to see something a little bit warmer from you, a little bit more playful, so I can understand the relationship between Nancy yeah. and Oliver and Dodger and the boys. That's I brilliant. want to see that mother Thank figure. You. That's brilliant. All right, thanks to the panel. Let's go to Andrew. <laughs> Rachel, uh, 
I need. Could either of them have the voice of Nancy, do you think? Well, they could. Barry, you've got to be careful. You could be arrested for headbutting an artist. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> I thought, Neve, you were really, really terrific tonight, but I think that you had a difficulty because the choreography probably didn't really help you. And that's a song that's quite personal. We're talking about words here. Rachel, I just said that uh, money notes have got to be made real and they've got to be about acting. You made them real. Thank you very much. You gave us the benchmark performance. Well, a great start to the show.